Hi there. Here's another quick product update from White Lance. So we now have an integration with LinkedIn, which will let your experts that onboard onto their platform input their LinkedIn URL when registering, and then that will automatically fill out their marketplace profile with all of the data which they've inputted in their LinkedIn account. So let's walk through how to do that all together and I'll demo um, how that works. These are the various fields which are available. So we can create a list of skills, uh, a list of languages and a list of volunteer experience as custom data items. Um, and then it'll automatically tag any exact matches which exist there. If you purely wanted these to appear for display purposes and not to be included in the matching algorithm, you could make these as string inputs instead of a single or multi-select list. Um, in addition to that, this integration will also pull out the uh, user's profile image, their job title, their accreditations or certifications, work experience, and education items. So let's work out how to set that up. I'll go down to um, data types. And here we see all of the various data types which um, already exist. Now, I've already created some of these uh, data types. So for example, languages um, I've created. It appears on the freelancer's profile page. And I've created several options um, just for this, this demo purpose. Um, and I've done the same for the custom LinkedIn. So this is a string input, which we want to be present on the registration page so that they can input their URL. Um, and then I've also created the other two fields, which were relating to volunteer experience um, and skills. It doesn't matter what you call these. Um, I'd suggest you perhaps name them um, LinkedIn underscore and then skills underscore languages, etc. So that then you know we need to input the exact same name here in our settings page. So let me go ahead and take a screenshot of these items so that I remember exactly how they're written. I move over to our settings, search for the LinkedIn feature. Wonderful. Let's turn that on. So the first one here is the name of the custom data type which we've created as an input field on the registration page and that one was custom underscore linkedin great i've already inputted it there the second one was relating to skills and so here we have uh custom underscore technical underscore skills make sure that there's no typos in that yes looks exactly the same uh, languages I haven't yet input, so let's do a custom underscore languages. And then the volunteer experience should be underscore volunteer underscore experience. Wonderful. Custom underscore volunteer underscore experience. There we have it. So now I can go ahead and save this. Let's just double check that that has saved correctly. Great, here all of that is. And so now what we're gonna do is move over to the platform itself. Move here to the registration page. And let me input my information. Yes, that's fine. Uh, let me just go and grab my LinkedIn URL. Great. So inputting my LinkedIn URL, um, let me create an email address.
Wonderful. And as you can see, this is a profile which I just created. Um, it's imported my profile image, uh, my job title, um, introduction or about me section. Um, it's already tagged some of my languages from that list that I've created. Um, and here also is work experience, portfolio, and education items. Um, if the end user hasn't inputted these fields on their LinkedIn profile, then they'll just remain blank. As you can see here, for example, with the technical skills, um, I haven't tagged myself in any of those items on my LinkedIn profile, so it wouldn't automatically fill in uh, any of that. And I also don't have any volunteering experience uh, listed on my profile, apparently. So that hasn't been uh, included. But I'm sure you'll find that this is a very valuable tool for your platform because effectively when your end users create an account on your marketplace, um, they will, one, have less work to do in order to fill out their profile information, and two, they will already be more committed to the marketplace because they'll be able to directly start searching and applying for positions um, without having to spend any extra time on that. Any questions, don't hesitate to reach out and thank you for your time.